The Enphase Envoy is a communications gateway that collects information about how your system is performing and transmits that information over the internet to MyEnlighten. In this video, we will explain how you can reconnect your Envoy S or IQ Envoy by manually establishing the Wi-Fi network connection. If you have changed your internet service provider, network password, or even updated your network name, your Envoy can get disconnected from your Wi-Fi network. Let's walk through the steps to re-establish the network connection. You will need a device that is already connected to your home Wi-Fi, such as a laptop, tablet, or smartphone. You will also need the password for your home Wi-Fi connection. The following troubleshooting steps can be used for the IQ Envoy, the IQ Combiner, or the Envoy S. Go into the Wi-Fi settings on your phone, tablet, or laptop, select the current Wi-Fi network, and tap on Forget This Network. Executing this step ensures that your device will not connect automatically to the current network. To start the troubleshooting steps, you will need to locate your Envoy first. Your Envoy may be tucked away in a utility room, or it may be found in your garage or outside in a watertight enclosure near your electrical circuit breaker panel or near an electrical sub-panel for your array. Once you have found your Envoy, continue with the steps to reconnect your Envoy to the internet. Do not hold, but just briefly press and release the Envoy menu button. This will enable access point mode or AP mode on your Envoy that creates a wireless network you can join with your phone or laptop. In case of IQ Combiner Box, you will find it here. If the AP mode LED next to the cell phone icon flashes green, wait for about two minutes for the light to stop flashing and try this step again. Note that if you see a solid green LED next to the cell phone icon, it means AP mode is successfully enabled and you may proceed. Join the Envoy's network using your phone Wi-Fi settings. Navigate to the Wi-Fi settings, ensure your Wi-Fi is on, and look for the Envoy's wireless network. The network name will include the last six digits of your Envoy serial number. In this case, here's the name of the Envoy Wi-Fi network. Tap on it to join this network. After you have joined the Envoy's network, you will see the status confirming that you are connected. Open a web browser on your device. In the address bar, type in the IP address displayed on the screen. Note that your device is not connected to the internet at this point it is connected to the Envoy's Wi-Fi network. Scroll down the screen to verify the serial number of your Envoy. Scroll up and find Wi-Fi. Tap on it. In the pop-up that appears, enter the username and password. Your username is Envoy, and the password is the last six digits of the Envoy's serial number. If your Envoy is already configured with another Wi-Fi network, you will be presented with a screen which looks like this. You will need to disconnect the Envoy from any existing networks to reconnect your Envoy to a new Wi-Fi network manually. To do this, tap on More Info under the Wi-Fi Network section to expand the settings and tap on Forget This Network. In the pop-up that appears, tap on Forget and Wait. Note that it may take up to three minutes to complete this step. Once completed, you will see a screen as shown here. If your Envoy was not configured with another Wi-Fi network, you will be directly presented with a screen which looks like this. Tap the View Networks button, then select your home network from the list of available networks. Note that the Envoy S or IQ prefers to connect with 2.5 GHz wireless band network instead of a 5 GHz network. Enter the password for your home network and tap the Connect button. The overview screen will confirm that you've successfully connected to your home network. If the top LED lights up solid green, then congratulations, you're back online. Your system now needs to resync, which can take anywhere from an hour to a few days, depending on how long your system was offline. If your Envoy is still offline, please contact your solar installer for assistance. You may also reach out to us at enphase.com support.